What's up, home skeleton sweet singer 422, and welcome back to Let's Play Trauma Team. Last time we left off, uh, we finished up uh, Naomi Kimishima's mission, um, partly thanks to uh, Body Biggs 217. Uh, she helped me out with the first part. I finished up the second part, and uh, we pretty much figured out a lot about the virus and a lot about um, pretty much who was responsible or who was patient zero I think. I could be completely wrong because it actually, it's been a long time since I've played this game. <laughs> but uh, a lot of stuff is starting to fall into place as far as figuring out this puzzle and I think everything is gonna come around and it's just gonna be like a big aha moment. Like I feel like this last episode was a big aha moment, you know? <laughs> but anyway, without any further ado, it's been too long. I'm ready to play. Let's go. Let's see. Hey, where are you going? This place... I grew up here, <laughs> at least until I started that fire. Why did we come here? We're looking for Rosalia Rosalini, right? It's coming back to me. Crybaby Rose. She was so small and was always sad. You know her? What an idiot. I saved her just that one time. But that kid, she remembered me. What do you mean? Uh, nothing. Look, at least we have a lead. Now let's go. So my question real quick, why didn't they just take a regular car? Did they have to drive the ambulance? <laughs> I just had to throw that in there real quick, you know? <laughs> Ross, Adele, damn, where is it? These records are over a decade old. Will they help us? <clears throat> We're not looking for records. I got news five years ago. The orphanage said that a letter had come for me. The incident at Cumberland College was eight years ago. If the letter is five years old, we could find Professor Sotch. Do you resent him? No. I... I just want to know what happened. I want the truth. I think we all want the truth. Aaron, Sylvia, these aren't it. Oh, care! Rosalia! Is that really it? Look, there's no mistake. It's her. Wow. <laughs> that idiot. The letter doesn't say anything. No return address. Actually... Hmm? Look at the picture. Monarch butterflies. But these flowers in the background are cosmos. So... Monarchs only stay in America until the end of the summer. That doesn't match the cosmos blooming season. Then you're saying... Right. This picture wasn't taken anywhere in America. W where was it taken then? At the end of the summer, the monarch butterfly. They head south to find Asclepius to feed the larvae. Heading south? Well, then that means... Yes. She's in Mexico. Mexico? Rose. What the... Ambulances. Tons of them. Uh, Damn, here there must we be go. something going on. We have to go. Is that you, Chief? Sorry I'm late. Maria, get back to Resurgum now! What's going on? I don't have time to 
to explain. Just get back here. <sighs> All right. Let's go. I still don't know why they took the ambulance. Five. Sorry we're late. Wow. And more. Oh my gosh. Listen carefully to me, Maria. Effective treatment varies depending on how far along it is. Okay. I'll tell you which medicines to use for each patient. Come. You! Why are you here? Save the talking for later. Let's begin the treatment. Ooh. Okay, anyway. Alright. Multiple pandemic patients have been brought to reserve. Some suffering from secondary injuries, more incoming. Yeah, I feel like this is gonna be a beast, and I'm probably going to lose, but... Start operation. <laughs> Alright, let's go. How can there be so many patients? That's what I want to know. It's not just the infected. Hold on. The people who are fainting and convulsing are causing secondary injuries. We just have to do this. I'm going to tell you about medication, so listen carefully. Okay. Now, as I mentioned earlier, there is no cure for the virus. However, its activities can be controlled using existing antiviral drugs. Okay. We'll be using an immunoglobulin reagent to specify the onset time. Okay. First, select the drug. The reagent is in the white vial. Use the syringe to inject it into the affected area. Nothing happened. What am I supposed to do now? Calm down. The drug is also a color reagent. Watch the area until the secondary body's HRP enzyme activity changes. Oh, color. this is gonna be hard. Are you kidding me? This is so inefficient. Should I check on the other patient until this reaction kicks in? I'll leave that decision to you. However, the reaction only lasts for a short period of time. Ah, uh, that's gonna suck. You should focus on this patient for now. Okay. Alright. The reaction of the reagent has colored So we inject it with the color that's corresponding. Now inject the antiviral drug of the okay. same color. Okay, that's actually area. not that. The drug is having an effect. That will suppress the virus's activities for a while. Damn, for a while? It can't cure it completely? Impossible. The conditions will worsen again over time. We have no choice but to re-inject the drug before that happens. So, we have to memorize which drug works on which patient and keep sticking them. Goddamn pain in the ass. I'm getting, a, I'm getting a little tired of that guitar, man. What the heck are you doing? <laughs> anyway, alright, I get it. There's no other way. We have to do this. Don't forget to treat the patient's wounds while injecting the drugs. Oh, they have wounds too, of course. Not just the virus. I got it. Damn it. Alright. Let's begin. Get ready for it. Let's see what we can do. Um... She's hemorrhaging a lot. It's from the abdomen. Beginning hemostasis. Get ready for it. Oh boy, it's, I knew it couldn't be that easy. She's flatlining. Charge the AED. Okay, I did. I did! Oh my god, it's gonna screw me over. I don't have time, I gotta work on the other patients. Okay. I gotta get to this one though. There's just no end to this. Uh oh, I don't 
don't want to do anything to him now. Okay. Alright, let's see. Uh, how about we stabilize this guy? Okay. Okay, um, get its vitals up. Okay, let's get this guy's vitals up. Looks like he isn't infected, but his left arm's broken. Okay, let's try to get his vitals up. Because I know when I try to move his arm, it's gonna drop like crazy. So let's do that first. Cool, alright, that's fine. This one will be easy, so I'll just continue with this. Oh no! Oh wow! Oh gosh! I didn't even notice. Oh man. Alright, let's try to fix this one. Come on, come on! Hurry the hell up already! Alright, let me try this. This one had a fracture in his left arm. Hang on, I'll treat that. Alright, now to bandage it together. Damn it, there's just no end to this! Okay, uh, red. <laughs> we did it! I feel like this is taken. This one had a fracture in his left arm. Hang on, I'll treat that. One more area to go. Cool. The operation be completely treated. Alright. Treat the hemorrhaging uh, and Maria. A military transport survivor. More? more what? More? I'll be right there. What am I supposed to do with this one? Oh no. Gosh, why is this happening? Let's check this one. Okay. Oh, sorry. Oh, you have to talk. What's the matter? Come on, talk to me. A girl. There was a girl collapsed in the hospital. Oh God. What? Maria, keep treating her. I'll contact the military and have them search for the girl. Got it. Hey, don't cool. worry. We'll make sure we save that girl, too. Thanks for letting us know. I'll stabilize you as much as I can. Um, I will treat these wounds. Um, I gotta stabilize this guy. Oh, Lord have mercy. I'll start extracting. <laughs> All right. Yeah, this guy, he was definitely not doing good. Alright, we got that, okay. Oh no, okay, sorry guy, I'm so sorry. That was long. Okay, um, let's do that real quick. Come on. Alright, let's check on the other ones first. He'll be fine for now, though. Okay. Okay. Alright, we're in. Cool. 
military's found another victim. It's that girl we heard about. Okay, at least we found that girl. All right. I'll take care of her. Send her up to me. Oh, birds. Here to allow her to be transported like this. What? Keep an eye on the EKG for signs of ventricular fibrillation. Okay. What else? Let's check this one. This one. She's infected with the virus. I got an injected the agent. Let's fix her. Oh man, I forgot. I'm. I was slow. I can't believe I freaking. It's taking these results so long. Damn it! There's just no end to this. This kid's infected. I gotta hurry and treat him. Oh god. She's infected with the virus. I okay. got an injected the agent. Blue. I completely forgot that I injected those other two. All right, she's good for transport. Okay. She's infected. I gotta hurry and treat her. Add a girl. Just a little more to go. Uh -oh. We'll make sure you're saved. Come on now. She's stabilized. Now it's our chance to transport. Good. More, of course. Maria, more vehicles are pulling up. We've got two more patients. Two of them? Oh, bring them over here. Can we not say we did? <laughs> oh my gosh, this was cr- oh, okay, I thought- I thought they were gonna be at one. I was gonna say, oh my gosh, they're screwed. Alright. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and handle you first. Yeah, we gotta... Hold on. He's got burns. Must have been a secondary victim. Come on, hang in there. Don't worry, you'll be killed in no time. He doesn't look infected, though. Thank goodness. All right, he's ready for transport. Wait, Get it's not gonna be that easy, is it? Yes, thank you. Right, let's check on this one. This one's got lacerations. No problem, we can treat these easily. We got you. Alright, you're gonna be good to go. We gotta take care of this kid. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna come back to you. Kid. Damn it! There's just no end to this. All right. Uh, come on, come on! Where the hell? This kid's infected. I gotta hurry and treat him. Damn! I hate this party. She's so damn. Damn it! There's just no end to this. Of course you can. We're bosses. I don't have any other choice. Let's do this. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This one's first. Infection and hemorrhaging due to secondary injuries. Damn, you have to do this. You are first. Okay. Get the immune 
coagulant reagent ready. Okay, let's check. Wait, hold on. Okay, never mind. All right. Uh, you will be kind of okay. Under his Sorry, but I gotta check. Uh, let's just get this over with. Injecting immunoglobulin reagent. Now we wait. This one's got lacerations and the infection. How far is this damn thing spread? The reagent's been injected. Let's see some color changes. Ugh. I can do this. What I'm feeling is nothing compared to their suffering. I'm not gonna lose this. You're gonna make it. We will cure you. Infection and lacerations. Right. I can do this. I got some antivirus, you bad. You won't come off my town. <laughs> All right. Sorry, I'm not talking so much with Maria's missions. It requires a lot of concentration. Uh oh, I gotta get to that one in the corner. Oh, come on, really? Oh God! Oh my gosh. We gotta get back to this one. <laughs> Alright. This is brutal, man. supposed to do with you? Oh, I'm stupid. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. That was embarrassing. Okay. Good We're good. <laughs> that was really dumb of me, but at least I figured it out rather quickly. Alright. Oh no. 
cool. At least she's not a hard stick. <laughs> that would be the struggle. Yeah, uh, well, hard stick is when you can't find the vein and you can't find where to uh, either get blood from or transfuse blood or whatever you have to do and uh, make an IV. Treatment complete. This one can be carried out. I'm going in to help the other doctors. You let the others know the patient's getting moved. You can count on me. If things get hairy, I'll jump in too. Damn it, how many people out there have this? It's an epidemic, come on now. Aw oh, man. Well, hopefully I get an A. B Very good. You dealt with each case quickly and casualties have been kept to a minimum. Giving it my all, you dimwit. If it had gotten any worse, we would have been screwed. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, guys. I wanted to get that A or even S, but I messed up too many times. I'm done. Is the transport ready yet? What the hell? Oh my gosh. We need to find a cure. Is it true you brought him here? Huh? What's that got to do with... No, no, you, you did a good thing. Get everyone, right now. What? Be serious, can't you see what's going on here? I see it just fine. This avalanche is picking up speed. Every second costs lives. I'll be in the conference room. Jeez, man. Damn it, what am I supposed to do? Chief! What are you doing? Hurry up and go. I'll take over here. What are you saying? I'm the paramedic. You should be... Can you carry all these lives? Don't be so cocky. Go, Maria. Don't run away from your responsibilities. Damn it. Hank, Tomoe, everyone, get to the conference room. Hmm, that's interesting. Okay. Wow. This is a very intricate story. Very, very, very intricate. Alright guys, that'll end it for this episode. Sorry this was such a short one. That's how Tomoe's missions tend to be. Obviously because she's a paramedic so she's just focusing on, you know, getting him to the next level of care, which would be the emergency room. She's just a paramedic or the chief doctor paramedic or whatever she is. <laughs> So she just runs through them like that, but uh, I already know that Hank's mission would probably take 30 minutes by itself, and that would probably leave this at a 45 minute or, mm, I don't know, it, it would this would be a long episode if I did the next one, so uh, in any rate, at any rate, I really appreciate you guys watching, I hope y'all have a great day slash night, and uh... Adios, some skillets.